What's up guys, it's Jared from Vandalistic Vlogs here and um, I was just in the live chat, actually I'm still in the chat but I just have these boys muted. Uh, Clovertech um, is talking about a guy who's uh, that's a political candidate out of uh, PA, George Scott, um, who's made an ad about common sense gun laws. <laughs> um, and assault weapon. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and watch this ad and we're gonna see what everybody's talking about. I've served in the army all over the world and I was trained to use guns like these. But Donald Trump's loyal soldiers like Scott Perry exploit guns and God to score political points. Not this time. I'm a veteran, a pastor, and a Democrat who believes in common sense and not blind loyalty. Ooh like gun safety to better protect our children and our communities. I'm George Scott and I approve this message because I won't be loyal to anyone but you. <laughs> oh, George Scott. George Scott. What are you doing? Um, okay. <laughs> okay. Man. Somebody gassed this guy up when, uh, when they said that this was a good idea. Okay, there is no way, first of all, um, that he was trained on a AR platform in 22. <laughs> that's just not, that's not a thing. They don't use 22 in the armed forces, that's ridiculous. And, see, I, I'm not even in any kind of armed forces, but it's common knowledge the rounds, you know, uh, the calibers that they use. And, you know, I've got friends from YouTube, you know, probably people watching this, um, that can confirm that. But that's common knowledge, so, okay, that's fine. Uh, he's commenting on how political opponents of his are using their past careers and their, their faiths uh, to win points. And then he just says how he's been, he's been in the armed forces and he's a pastor. So, you, you literally just said, you people are bad for doing this, and then did it yourself. Not this time. Idiot. Okay. <laughs> and <laughs> this is the most amazing thing. He, okay. So he takes the magazine out of the gun. He separates the upper and the lower. And then he just dumps them in a fire? What are you doing? How is that? You, do you know what this is? This is the Me Too of Not One More. It's exactly what it is. He's seen that whole Not One More thing happen, however many, what was that, like three, four months ago or something, and then he's gone, hashtag Me Too, hashtag Not One More, and done the same thing, which is basically destroyed a firearm by not destroying. Like, I thought you're former military you should know that you can now just pull that out of the fire, take the furniture off it, put different furniture on it. Dumping it in a fire is not gonna, it's not gonna hurt the, the receiver, it's not gonna do anything to any of those parts except for the furniture. You swap the furniture out and you're all good. Political grandstanding and, and virtue signaling, to what end? It just makes you look stupid and I'm I, I honestly, somebody had to gas you up to do that. Somebody would have to have said, You know what? Let's jump on this bandwagon from four months ago. People probably still remember that. It'll be great. You'll throw it in a fire. You look like you're on a farm, so you must be all American. And if you're for the people, why are you openly <laughs> trying to attack their gun rights? It's your constitution, you idiot. It's what people, it's what people fought for, it's what people continue to fight for, and you say you're on the side of the people, but let's just take away this particular part of your, of the Bill of Rights. What a goose. What an actual goose. Anyway, Josh Scott, you jack wagon. Good luck with it.